On Tuesday, we found out that the U.S. home prices in April saw the biggest gain in two years, but they are expected to drop by next year. The Spanish unemployment rose in May, a no-deal Brexit threat looms over the pandemic-ravaged UK, and the U.S. cities erupt in more violence amid threats from Trump. Welcome to the Tickmill Update. I'm Kiana Daniel, the founder of the Invest Diva movement. Make sure to subscribe to the Tickmill YouTube channel and support us by liking and sharing this video with your forex trading friends. On Wednesday, we'll be looking at the Swiss GDP, Germany's unemployment, and Canada's interest rate decision. Today, I'm looking at the CAD yen pair, which finally broke above the consolidation range as well as the daily Ichimoku cloud beginning of the week and reached the key resistance level and the 38% Fibonacci retracement level of 80.58. As the Ichimoku indicator suggests, we could see a temporary pullback here towards 79.33 before seeing further gains towards 82. Do you think the new bullish momentum is here to stay? Head over to the comment section and let me know. Of course, trading in the financial markets involves a risk of loss and you should only trade the money that you can afford to lose. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the Tickmill YouTube channel. I'll get back to you with more updates tomorrow.